Hello everyone and welcome to another video of Google Struct and this video is going to be about the guy extension I've been working on uh, if you don't know what guy is I'll put a link in the description so you can check it out if you haven't already um, guy is basically a tool for creating really beautiful terrains and in fact this this scene was created by guy and, and as you can see it's very beautiful um, so what I, show you, what I want to show you in this tutorial is how you can get any scene to work with Gaia or actually with Google Struct by using Gaia extension uh, with one button click so what I have in this project is a scene created by Gaia and you construct that from the asset store I don't have anything you construct related in here um, the terrain is in a socket the player doesn't have any you construct related, th related things and don't have any of the you construct layers created so let's get it started let's go into Gaia show Gaia manager Gaia extensions and go into you construct and you're going to see in here four buttons. The first one is just a readme information. We're going to see in here a bit of information about the system and it's also going to tell us if the layer, if the default layers are created. Um, in our case it's not created because we're just going from the asset store but the magic trick is that if I'm going to click in here it's going to automatically create the layers for you. So you don't need to manually add the layers yourself. Um, we also have in here initiate managers, which is going to create the call the Ucostruct callback manager in the scene. Uh, you don't have to do that because this callback will be created anyways on runtime, but it's just a way for you to remove a bit of overload from uh, the startup of the of the game. So, uh, oops, let's go back into the game manager, and you're also going to see in here apply demo to scene. Now, this is the be the coolest thing about this extension. If I want to click this button, all of the Ucostruct demo is going to be added into the scene automatically so if you want to click on that as you can see gonna go, we're going to go ahead and the terrain and see that the terrain has now a socket created on it you're also going to see that the player has um, some building place the building place it also has the AUI stuff um, and we also have the canvas created and everything let's go ahead and click play let's see um, lock screen. and as you can see we can buildings we have the controls showing up um, the grass has been cl is cleaned when placing buildings we can place some um, pillars if you want we can place some pillars uh, we can place walls ceilings um, door whatever we want really let's go ahead and remove this door in this case uh, but yeah it's really cool as you can see um, and yeah if you have any more questions, uh, oh, and by the way, the class also works. And yes, if you have any more questions, I'm here to help. And uh, 